Hey, hey, Coach Isai here coming to you from Northern Virginia. <clears throat> Are you taking notes and uh, every time you go to webinars or, you know, you watch a webinar or you go to an event or you read a book or, you know, a blog or whatever the case, are you taking notes uh, so that you can really like learn and ingest uh, uh, like what you're, what you're consuming and, and basically use that? Uh, in your own <clears throat> in your own business. Well, if you are, I'm sure um, you probably have like a whole stack of uh, you know just notes like uh, everywhere in your you know in your work area. And um, I'm going to show you a little trick on how you can take all them notes and um, you can make that you can turn that into cash. So that's that's today's uh, that's today's topic: how to take the, your notes and uh, make that, you know, convert that into cash. So, uh, first of all, if you don't know who I am, my name is Isai Rodriguez. I'm a uh, network marketing professional and a business coach. Uh, so, how is everybody? How are you doing? I already see a couple of thumbs ups, a couple of hearts. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the love. Um, yeah, I have to apologize again. My, I still haven't gotten my hair done. <laughs> <laughs> and we're cutting it close because I'm going on vacation soon. So, you know, I need to get this done ASAP. Not to mention that, you know, I haven't I haven't packed it. So I'm kind of slacking in that, in that department. Um, but anyway, uh, oh, did you guys hear about um, the, did you hear about Donald Trump? Um, uh, he just named some kind of morning um uh, National Morning Day for one of our ex-presidents, so I get a day off this Wednesday from my day job. How good is that? Anyway, I just thought I'd share that. I kind of made my day. I learned that as I was running out the door uh, today. Uh, you know, it just kind of gave me a little boost of energy. Anyway, so back to the topic at hand. Um, notes. Um, so I, I want to talk to you guys about uh, a little method that we uh, implement uh, or that we teach um, at Elite Marketing Pro, and I've used this uh, ever since I joined them, and I've, I've seen my business take off, you know, um, tenfold. I would say I, mean, I gotta look at the numbers, but you know, whatever. But but this little method is called. Um, we, we, we named it um, the ILT method. That's the uh, invest, learn, teach method. And with this method, you can take all them notes that you're taking from, you know, whatever videos you're watching and, um, and basically turn that into, um, into cash. And let me explain to you how, because, you know, first of all, we have the, the I portion of the ILT method, and that's uh, that's the time and the money that you invest in yourself. The I is for investment. You're, you're, all, you're continuously investing in yourself, whether you're buying a seminar or a webinar or you're attending a, uh, you know, a company event or you're buying a book or an audio book or, you know, whatever that, you know, whatever the case may be, you're always uh, investing in yourself. And you, and the L of the ILT is, is learning. So you're investing uh, in your business, in yourself, you're learning stuff, you know, uh, from from what you're investing in, and that's all, you know, that and that's where that's where the note taking comes in. You know, I'm sure you're you're learning this trick and that trick and this philosophy and that um, uh, tidbit, and, uh, and and you're you're taking these notes and they're just kind of randomly everywhere. Uh, you know, uh, different notepads or, you know, maybe you have them on your computer, whatever, you know, whatever your daily method of operation is, uh, you know, we, what, what we want to do is take all the notes and eventually or essentially uh, uh, convert that into cash. And, and the way we do that is the third and final um, uh, point in this method, which is the T, which is for, which stands for uh, teach. So as you're investing in yourselves, a, as you're learning and taking notes, you have these notes and they're everywhere, but you're not, you're not utilizing that. You're not taking that, you know, what those notes, you're not taking what you, 
what, what you've invested in yourself and sharing that with people. You're not teaching anybody with um, uh, that information that you're, you're, that you're consuming. You're not, you're not uh, you know, paying it back, as they call it, paying it forward uh, to the community. And, and that's one of the biggest things that I noticed um, uh, with my team, especially uh, where, you know, again, they're, they're investing in themselves they're learning the information, but they're not teaching it. So, um, and, and this this is this is a critical component, and, and it's it's uh, you know I, I'm pretty sure that because um, I've done it myself. You know, I'm not I, I say this uh, uh, with an open heart. I should say, like you know, I've I've done this where I, I'm I'm consuming and I'm take you know I'm reading and, and, and I'm watching videos, but I'm not I'm not necessarily sharing it with anybody. One of the most important things um, f of learning any topic is, is teaching it. When, when you can teach something to someone else, you, you, you get that much closer to, uh, to mastering uh, what it is that you've learned and what you're teaching. Because you have to think about it in a certain way to explain it to somebody that may or may not understand the broad concept that you're trying to uh, explain to them. So by sharing with your community, with your audience, um, you begin to build um, your brand, your authority with them uh, by, you know, just by sharing whatever it is that you, that, that you learn, uh, you take that, you repackage it, and you put it out there, whether it's in a blog, whether it's a podcast, whether it's live video, recorded video, it doesn't matter. Just get it back out there. And, um, uh, you know, so, so a lot of times, so let, let me give you a little, uh, something that I do a lot of times is that, and you'll, it'll probably happen to you eventually, is that as you start consuming and taking the notes and sharing, teaching, your train of thought starts to uh, change, whereas um, when you used to simply, um, you know, learn and, and consume that data, uh, that that information, that data. Uh, now, when when you do the same thing, now you're thinking. You start thinking to yourself, "Hmm, how can I, like, what can I take from this and share with my audience?" Because here's the thing. Yeah, there's there's a ton of information out there, but not every little thing is going to apply to your business. And like, okay, there's there's going to be larger concepts that yeah, they they will um, they will pertain to you, like they will apply to your business. Uh, but there will be small little details um, um, or, or tips or whatever the case may be that you know that just don't. Um, they don't fit with the way you're running your business. Uh, for instance, so like say right now my major thing is, uh, you know, blogging and uh, live video and, and other videos, uh, recorded videos. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm still getting over my code. Um, and basically repackaging what I learned into a either um, a blog post or maybe a live video like I'm doing now. And um, so, for so so like if if I'm reading, uh, you know, if I come across a, uh, a an article that's talking about you know whatever, the, let's say they're talking about podcasting and like um, what kind of mics you know work best uh, for podcasters or, or what recording uh, equipment you should use or software or. So, Whatever the case may be. The point is, is that I may read it, I may enjoy it, and it may pique my interest, but it doesn't flow with the way I'm running my business. Again, I'm, I'm doing, um, I'm general, for the most part, um, uh, I'm building my brand through, uh, again, blog, uh, my blog post, um, and through live video. And so, something to the effect of like podcasting though there may be a few things here and there that pertain to you know marketing or network marketing 
Um, but the overall, um, uh, you know, the, the overall theme of audio podcasting doesn't work for me. You know what I mean? Like there wouldn't be much there for me to implement and or to share with you. Uh, because that's not the way I'm building my brand. Now, if I were building my brand uh, through an audio podcast, then yeah, you know, maybe I would, you know, share that with you. But the, the, the fact of the matter is that I don't, so I wouldn't. But what I do share with you are things that I feel are relevant with uh, my audience. Um, again, blogging, and video so uh, and and you know to basically to wrap it up here um, you want to be paying forward what you learn back to you know back into the community so we have this big community this global community of, of network marketers and um, you know, everybody's building their own, uh, you know, their own business, their way, you know, how whatever works for them. And, uh, you know, we're taking little bits or, or else, you know, I mean, I am anyway, you know, I'm taking little tips from here, from this, from this leader and that leader and this uh, person and that person and my upline and, and sometimes even my downline. They have a, you know, an, a, a, an idea that, you know wow, I didn't think of it. You know, they, they come up with something and I'm like, you know, thinking out the box. I didn't think of that. So I take, I kind of aggregate uh, all this information. I put it in a, you know, you know, I, I, I take the information, I use it, I apply it to my business and then I take that, repackage it and I deliver that to you. So that's my little spiel for the day. I hope you found value in this and, um, if you did, I would really love your thumbs up, maybe a little heart action up there. You can drop me a little hello, let me know where you're coming from. I'd love to hear from you. Send me a message. I'm here for you. Take care. Bye.